Astronaut Handbook by Megan McCarthy. Astronaut Handbook, Megan McCarthy. Welcome to astronaut school. Soon you will be boarding a space shuttle and blasting into outer space. All different kinds of people have become astronauts. There have been teachers, painters, and even deep sea divers. You can be an astronaut too. First, you need to decide what kind of astronaut you will be. There are astronauts who fly the space shuttles, astronauts who conduct scientific experiments such as growing plants, and astronauts who repair satellites. Becoming an astronaut takes a lot of preparation. It's important to study hard at school. Studying isn't always easy, but stick with it. You will have to pass some tough fitness tests to become an astronaut, so suit up and start swimming. One test is to swim in your flight suit and sneakers. It's also important to be a team player. While in space you'll be eating, sleeping and working in very tight quarters with many other people, so be nice to your neighbor and no fighting. Now that you can work well with others, it's time for survival training. This training will help toughen you up and prepare you to live in harsh conditions. After you're both mentally and physically prepared, it's time for the real work to begin. Practice makes perfect. Those of you who have decided to become engineers will practice working with machines much like the ones you'll use in space. Those of you who want to be a pilot of the space shuttle, you will need to learn how to fly. You've done the hard stuff and now it's time to have some fun. A special plane nicknamed the Vomit Comet will take you high in the sky and then zoom back down. As a result, you'll be able to float. It might upset your stomach, but you'll get the hang of it. You'll also need to pick the food you'd like to eat while in space. It's important to have a balanced diet to stay strong during your trip. You can even have dessert such as freeze-dried ice cream. Mm. This is what a space toilet looks like. And here's what your spacesuit will look like. You'll wear this suit while working outside the space shuttle. It's white to reflect the rays of the sun. It will be fitted to your exact measurements. Over 100 measurements will be taken of your hand alone. Finally, it's time to blast off. Put on your orange flight suits, worn for takeoffs and landings, and get ready to board the space shuttle. You'll have to sit for as long as three hours before liftoff. Get ready for the ride of your life. Three, two, one, blast off! It's best to like small spaces. So work hard and then you can enjoy your time in space.